If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. As an owner of a sole proprietorship or partnership, a capital investment is personal money you or a business partner invests into the business. You use an equity account to track capital investments. QuickBooks Online creates a default owner's investment equity account for new sole proprietorship companies that you can use for this purpose if needed. To record a capital investment, click the plus new button in the navigation bar and then click the Bank Deposit link under the other heading in the menu to open the Bank Deposit window. Select the account into which to deposit the money from the Account drop-down. Then select the Deposits date from the Date Calendar Selector field. If needed, add any tags by using the Tags field. In the first blank row in the Add Funds to this Deposit section, Select the name of the owner or partner from whom the funds were received from the Received From drop-down. If the owner or partner isn't set up as a vendor, click the Add New Choice in the drop-down menu to add the name of the owner to the vendor's list. Then select the name of the equity account used to track capital investments from the adjacent Account column, like the Owner's Investment Equity Account, for example. You can enter a description of the investment into the Description field. Then select the payment method the investor used from the Payment Method drop-down. If there is a transaction number, like a check number, to record for the investment, you can enter it into the Reference Number field. Finally, enter the investment amount into the Amount column. To save the deposit and print a deposit slip in Summary or Summary Only, Click the Print button and then select either Print Deposit Slip in Summary or Print Deposit Summary Only as desired. Note that the deposit is not saved until you select either one of these commands. Alternatively, to save the deposit and then create a new deposit or close the window, either click the drop-down button at the right end of the toolbar to perform the current choice shown or click its drop-down arrow to select the alternate choice from the pop-up menu. Selecting Save and New saves the current deposit and opens a new deposit window. Selecting Save and Close saves the deposit and closes the window. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www dot teachyoucomp dot com